Hi guys, uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to install Android 4.3 in VirtualBox. Uh, it's pretty easy. So the only things you really need uh, are VirtualBox and a version of Android. I'm using 4.3. Uh, so we're just going to go and just type in VirtualBox. Yep. And just download from CNET. I'll have a link in the description for that. Also, you're going to want to go to this website. I'll have a link in the description for this also. And you click here to download, okay? It'll take about mm, two minutes. Download something like that. Um, you just save it. Okay, after that's done, you go down and you just open up VirtualBox and click new. Uh, I'm going to call it Android 4.3. Uh, I saved it as Linux, Linux 2.6 slash 3, and then I click Next. Um, depending on how much RAM you have installed in your system, uh, you can go from the low to the high end. So if you have 4 gigs, I would suggest something like 512 uh, megabytes, something like that. Uh, 8, you could probably go with you know 2 gigs. I have 16, so I'm going to go up to about 4 gigs of RAM. It'll just make it so uh, it'll be able to handle more applications, stuff like that. Um, yeah, create a virtual hard drive. Pretty much just go along with the defaults on most of these unless you know what you're doing and you specifically want something else. Next, uh, yeah, I want to save this somewhere different, so I'm going to go there. I have all my stuff in one folder, so I like to save them all there, so save in a special folder. Okay, and 8 gigs, good. Okay, so I'm going to create that. Okay, go into settings real quick and uh, just change the number of CPUs. This will also depend on your specific um, hardware configuration. Uh, you can usually just leave it as default. I just have a few tweaks that I always make, but just you can leave it as default. I don't want anything. Okay. Uh, after that, we're going to click uh, Start. And then here we're going to locate our ISO file. So I have it saved in my ISO thing. Uh, it's going to be in your downloads folder unless you moved it. So just click on that and click Open, and then click Start. Uh, once you get to this screen, you're going to go down to the installation, the bottom one, the installation, install Android uh, x86 to hard disk, and hit enter. Uh, click OK, or hit enter. OK, so select OK. Now go over one with your arrow keys to the new, and hit enter. Uh, select primary, hit enter. Hit enter one more time. Uh, hit enter, okay, select bootable, it'll, there you go, hit enter, and then navigate uh, to right, it's right down there in the bottom right, uh, and hit enter. Um, now type in yes on your keyboard and hit enter, and wait for it. Okay, now we can go down and select quit and hit enter. Um, now we hit enter one more time to start our install. Uh, go down to extent, uh, sorry, extended 3, so ext3, and hit enter. Uh, hit enter again. Uh, uh, use your arrow, your left arrow key to select yes, and then hit enter. Yes, we want to install, so click uh, enter again. Uh, here we're going to go down and click Reboot. Uh, now we can go into Devices and remove our virtual disk, okay? So let's make sure. Alright, yeah, okay, I removed it. Um, now I'm just going to X this out. Power off machine, okay. Restart it. And hit enter.
All right. Uh, you have to go up here and click machine, disable mouse integration, click that, and then click here uh, and click enter and your mouse will pop up like that. Uh, and you can select the one you want. You can also use your arrow keys. Just click, click start. This is going to take a few minutes. Yeah, it's making a little weird noise, but just going to take a few minutes. Um, so I'll be back in a sec. Yeah, I'm talking right now, but I'm going to cut this out. Okay, so once that's done, uh, well, I'm just going to click skip on this and just do skip anyway. I'm just doing this for a demo. You can go ahead and set it up with your Wi-Fi and stuff. Uh, no, not now. Yeah, it's making weird clicking noises. Uh, that's weird. I'm just running through this. You can go through and do actual, um, your actual stuff. That's not, uh, you know, I'm just doing that just to show you you can get in and start doing things. So, yeah. Pretty good. Everything's working pretty well. Uh, you can go on to, whoops, do you want, mm, not now, the YouTube. And, uh, not now. As you can see, it's being a little bit irritating. Go on and, you know, watch videos and stuff. I'm sorry, that clicking noise is distracting me. Uh, so let's just say, fun stuff. Does a search on fun stuff. Yeah. So, um, if you did what I just did, it's not going to have Flash pre-installed, um, and it's I don't have the internet connected. Uh, you can do those things pretty easily in VirtualBox, um, and through Android. So just you know, play around with it, figure it out, get it the way you want it, and that's all there is to it. Bye bye.